Congratulations on winning this special award from the Football Writers Association. Thank you very much. When you look at the list of some of the greatest names in English football history, what does it mean to you to be joining them? Um, I'm really proud. I'm really proud because uh, in this list there's a lot of players that I really respect and, and, and I grew up. I grew up and I played trying to, to reach their level. So for me it's a, it's a great honour to, to to be among those players. Uh, how do you feel your relationship is with the football writers over the years? How, how has it been? I think it's fantastic because the evolution of it was uh, it's something it's something very special. You know, um, when I came, it was difficult because first there was the, the the language barrier, who didn't help, who didn't help, and also the different of two cultures. Um, and with time, we managed to. To, to to learn more from from each other and and today I'm really happy because not only that they are, they understand what I what I'm doing on the pitch but they also helped me a lot with my foundation work and this is really special for me you know they came to Abidjan to to, to do some some work with me on the foundation mm -hmm. and they've been help very helpful also in the in my uh, foundation dinners so it's the relation is fantastic. And of course you've come back to Chelsea now, it's an exciting season, yesterday's uh, FA Cup defeat was obviously... Well, was not so exciting yesterday. Wasn't so exciting, <laughs> but the Champions League, the league title, the Premier League title is very much uh, capable this season. Yeah, 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 of course, uh, everything is capable, but at the same time, um, you can lose everything like, we, like yesterday. So, I think we need to, to stay focused on what we want to achieve, but also at the same time we have to play game by game, especially now from now until the end of the season because uh, that's the part of the season where everything decides or matters more. Liverpool first in the, in the Capital Cup, One Cup semi-final and then Manchester City in the Premier League. Does the defeat to Bradford make you more spurred on to, to get results in those two? Oh, we need, you know, and after a defeat, you always want, always want to bounce back, and I think uh, that's what we're going to do on, on, on Tuesday. We hope to do. And Jose, just a word about Jose and the part he's played in your career. It's, again, it's a special relationship. Isn't it? Yeah, because I've I've known him for almost ten years now. Uh, from the day he, I spoke to him when I was in the in, uh, in Marseille in the in the in the tunnel on the way to the pitch. Uh, until now, he's, he's the same man, you know, the man who, who gave me his words and he always respected and, and, and did what he, what he was promised, promising. And he persuaded you to come back this year. Is there anything beyond that? Where are your plans beyond next summer? Do you, do you, do you think you stay at Chelsea I or go into coaching? I hope, I, hope I'm, I'm, uh, I, I want to believe and, and, and the club makes me believe that I'm part of the of the, the, the of this uh, big family, so we're gonna find the best thing for, for for both of us, you know, to to promote the club in the best way. Fantastic. Well, thanks again, and, Thank and, you and very much. congratulations on your Thank award. Thank you. Thank you. Very